Don't miss out on the special offer from my sponsor, Buy Madden Coins. They're currently giving you 20% off if you use my coupon code Poodle at checkout and also giving you an additional 10% coins at checkout. Hey, what's going on, everybody? It's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate Team video. And today, I'll be going over some market talk. I haven't done this in like maybe a week and a half. It's been a while. Sorry for the lack of content, guys. There's two reasons. First off, Madden's very dead. It's very hard to find things to do. Also, I have one. I have like a blister on my tongue again from biting it, so it's very hard to talk and eat and stuff. So that's also another reason why I've kind of been avoiding making one of these videos in a few days. But sorry for that. Obviously, once Madden 20 gets closer and we're back on that grind, I will be posting like three times a day. Like you're gonna be getting like like 15 to 20 videos a week. It's gonna be unreal. But that's for that's at that time. So they're gonna have to be a little bit different. But if you guys are new here, guys, drop a sub. Obviously, we haven't grown much since about March, to be completely honest with you. It's been very slow, but it's very expected at this point in the game. Very expected. I can't really complain. But, still trying to get a little bit more guys here in the family before we get over to Man 20. Hopefully, we can get, I hope, like 2.5k at least. Maybe closer to 3k, but, you know, it all depends on things go. Probably not, but we'll try. Also, if you guys are here, let's drop a like. Like I said, I will be doing giveaways every day from now until Madden 20. So, obviously, all the coins in my account will be going to giveaways. Obviously, I have more coins. I'm just going to sell the players I got from the pack opening. So, all you got to do is drop a like. Comment down below 500k. And I will be picking winners if we hit 110 likes. If we hit 110 likes, I will be picking a winner. Forward. So, all you got to do is comment down below. And if there's only 110 people, that's not a really bad odds of winning. And I will be doing this every day from now until Madden 20. And I'll start giving away players on my team. So turn on that bell icon on my channel. So you guys can always get notified when I post the videos. You can come into the giveaway. Even if you don't watch, you can still enter the giveaway. It's all good. But now let's get into the video. So let's head over to the market. I haven't... It's changed a lot. Because I haven't been on it as... I haven't been on it in like a week. So it looks it looks a lot different, obviously. So if you come over to, you come over to Ultimate Legends, I always like to start the filters on the market talk. You're going to say... Walter Payton is 117. Calvin Johnson's 123. These are crazy cheap. Michael Vick is 150k. Rodney Harrison 99 overall is 150. I didn't even know this card came out. It's insane safety right there for super, super cheap. If you're going to build a team, honestly, now's the time. Things are going to get cheaper, but not by much. Barry is 192. This is prime time to build. A team, honestly, if you if you ever have one in mind to build. Why is Mike? Oh, limited time. You could honestly, you could put together a 99 overall squad for probably under 2 million coins, which sounds like a lot. But let me tell you, uh, like three months ago, putting together a team like mine would have, like three players cost 90, it would have cost 2 million coins. Like if I, when I bought Calvin and Sean Taylor, they combined for like 1.2 million coins, just two of them. Now they're 200k together. Like that's just my that's just the point like you can do so much now if you want to like you'll put together such a good team for like it took me months to get 96 overall let's say you could put that together with maybe 700k maybe mil let's see the 97 full legend steve outwater and 97 mike i'll start i'll yeah i'll start is 77k 74k 70k 70k <clears throat> this is what sucks all right imagine you pull this is what like really bad about this now the ultimate legend packs right i was thinking this like last week you pull an ultimate legend pack it cost 120k it costs a lot but the hype is that the hype for it used to be you get a full pull or a full or a, one of the top pieces you make your money right because the top piece used to be 160k so you make your money back or if you pull a full one you make triple the money right so that was the hope for it now if you pull a full one you lose money if you pull a 98 calvin johnson which you think is insane you just lost with reduction like 12k if you pull a rodney harrison 99 overall could you imagine that 99 overall of a pack you pull that with reduction you made 20k so if you pull this pack 30 times, you're probably going to lose coins 28 times out of 30. Two times you might get a 99 overall. In that case, you make 40k. But you also lost probably 340k. Maybe more. So it's kind of ass at this point. 
they've rendered ultimate legend packs unusable now imagine if you pull a piece could you imagine like it used to the pieces used to be like 20 30k right so like, you made some, a piece with a few other players you only lost like 60k now imagine if you pull a piece 10k you could literally leave this pack with like 10 to 20k let's just lose 100k flat okay remember back when you could pull like a 90 a 90 piece like a michael vick and make like 70k no 10k so maybe you pull a 95 overall piece the top piece in the set you used to pull this piece and you're like okay i made my money back you lost more than half the money of the pack after reduction is there a vic let's see what the vic's going for Sorry, I'm yawning. Okay, so Vic, same thing. Still losing half the pack after reduction. It's kind of unreal, to be honest. It's kind of, it's kind of sucks. I mean, packs are kind of now. Now at this point, I really wouldn't understand why you open packs. Pack, unless pack prices cut in half, like guys make Ultimate Legend packs like 60k. If they don't do that, it's not, there's no point. It's unreal. They're charging us still a pack that costs this much. And look, oh wait, that's the that's the best card you can get. The best card you can get would still lose your money. Like the best card you can get from that pack which still lose your money it just it doesn't add up at this point anymore now let's get to positional heroes i haven't looked at them in a while to be honest with you guys so let's see how they're looking i know they went down i gave you guys advice i told you guys to sell all of them while we had the chance because i did say they would go from 220 down to about 150. i did say exactly that i said at the highest they will be at 170 and they're at 150. russell wilson is down to 160 he was going for like 240. Michael Thomas down to 170. Jalen down. Jalen will stay higher up at 170 because he isn't actually good. He's a, he's a good card. And Jamal Adams. But where are the new ones? Justin Tucker. I actually really like this card. I really like this card. He's my favorite kicker. Always like this card. But he's always too expensive because he is Justin Tucker. Now, any advice for these right now, guys? If you have them. Still, just sell them because they're not going back up. If you don't, if you're, if you're not, if you don't plan to use them for the rest of the year, sell them because they're going to be on your team, wasting space. Because if you're holding them in hopes of getting more points, don't bother. If you're holding them because you like them, keep them. At this point in the year, it doesn't, it's going to be relevant right now. At this point in the year, if you, if you like cards, don't even try making a profit. Just sell. Just sell. I mean, if you like them, just keep. Just play with them. Enjoy the game. Enjoy what's left of this game. And if you're just keeping them on your on your binder like I do to sell just sell there's no point of waiting anymore now what is left of this game to look at i don't believe there's much i'll go to all but i don't think there's much left on this market i feel like those are the two most relevant things color smash are irrelevant i guess the rookie the rookies are there remember rookie premieres coming in not not too long should not be too, maybe a month month and a half so don't, don't forget to have money saved up for the Rick premieres. Those are going to be cool to have. So definitely don't mess up with that. Make sure you have money when it comes time. We got JC Hayward Master. That's, that's old. Hmm. So boys, that's about it for the market. The market is at its end. There's not much left on this. There's literally two things here. Ultimate Legends that came out months ago. And Precision Heroes that just came out. That's about it about it guys so don't forget if you're new here if you're always here if you're sometimes here be sure to drop a like down below enter the giveaway don't forget to comment 500k down below because it's not just about getting the comment it's literally that i randomize the comments using a app or a program whatever you want to call it so if you don't comment you literally can't be entered even if you like the video because i can't pick by likes i can only pick by comments so make sure you like the video and once you do that go comment down below 500k comment down below whatever and don't miss out because 500k is a lot of coins. Jack could literally be a rookie premiere. Maybe even more than 500k. I have to sell the stuff I made from that pack opening and then we'll see. But guys, thank you so much for watching. And all of you guys who are going to come out to this video. I know I've been posting a while, so this video is probably going to do pretty bad. But thank you guys anyways. I do appreciate all of you who still watch this one. Even especially you guys who don't even play this game anymore. I know a lot of you guys don't. I know a lot of you guys just come to watch and I appreciate that. So, if you're one of those guys, thank you so much. Hope you guys enjoy every few videos that I post for the rest of the man season. Come out. Don't miss out. Just come enter the giveaway. You can leave afterwards. I don't really mind. Just come enter it. Someone come win this giveaway. And then Madden 20 is not too far away. We're about a month and like 20 days. No, I'm really dumb. Wait, am I? June. 
No, we're like a month, 25 days away from Madden 20, so that's not bad at all. Cannot wait. Gonna be a whole new, a whole new poodle. It's gonna be a whole new Madden season. I cannot wait to do that, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you guys have been enjoying the content. I'm out. See you guys in the next video.